All right. Hello and welcome to what will be the final part of this playthrough of Crash Bandicoot 1. So we're about halfway through the island, the third island. So we might as well just finish it off. Uh, this one, we should get the, uh, the special gem. So no dying, of course. That's going to be a little tough. Um, they did a similar premise to this type of level in the second game, only instead of the masks uh, being your light source, it was obviously a... Um, it was fireflies. Um, so a little bit different, but, you know, if you get hit with this... Um, you know, you lose your light source, obviously, but that was not the case with the fireflies. If you had a mask, you could take a hit and the firefly wouldn't necessarily go away. Um, so that was a little bit different, obviously, but, you know, you take what you get. Bullshit! Okay, well, we gotta retry that then. <laughs> ah, yeah. There's the rub. All right. Well, we only have two more gems to get, and then we can die as many times as we want to. This one, it you know, in the grand scheme of things, not too hard. Um, I think actually the other lights out type level is hidden away behind like we need a key to get to that bonus level for another lights out type level um and that one's actually tough although again we can die as many times as we want in this iteration of the game in the uh, original format not true if we want the gem but yeah that one's that one's pretty tough so you know this one in the grand scheme of things they really kind of throw you for a loop with this mechanic, so it's not too difficult beyond, you know, needing light sources that we had. Ah, oh, fuck! That we hadn't really, you know, we, we this is the first our first rodeo with this. God damn it! Okay, so we'll get it. It might take a few tries, but we'll get it, and then. Obviously, we'll backtrack uh, and go use the purple gem where it needs to be used. But yeah. I love the music, too, for this. It's, it's really cool. Okay. Okay. Yeah, as you can see, only 15 boxes that we need to get from this level, so not too demanding in terms of box total. But again, we just have a few interesting challenges based on some mechanics that we haven't really... Oh god, okay. Haven't really encountered before. Okay, and again, if we get hit, uh, we lose our light source, so... I'm gonna try to avoid that. Oh, and never mind. We need another special gem, so... Who cares? I thought... I thought we could do it, but we can't. So, yeah, we're gonna need to come back to this one. Ooh. Okay. Yeah. Well, never mind. We'll have to get the uh, other gem elsewhere, and then we'll have to come back. We have to backtrack for a special gem, which I think is the first time we've had to do that. 
Now, Jaws of Darkness, though, we can, because we have the blue gem. And this is a key level, so... So we know we're going to have a Cortex bonus stage. Oh! Okay. Okay. Something's happening with the... Yeah. I wonder if the uh, batteries are low on this controller. I might, I might have to switch uh, to a different controller because sometimes I'm pressing the jump button and it's just not. Res yeah. Okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna switch controllers. Actually, let's do it. Weird. Yeah, I'm still gonna switch though. Okay. Let's try that again. Oh, much better. Okay. Yeah, I don't know what's going on. Um. Maybe I, like, didn't clean it properly. Yeah, I was just wondering if there was something over there, but clearly not. Okay, yeah, we've got quite a few boxes to get to in this level. But again, we can die as many times as we want, so I'm not too worried. We do just want to be vigilant for kind of the Cortex bonus heads. Because I think compared to the other level, they're actually very well hidden. Okay, yeah, I think I think there's one up here actually. No. It was it was right there. Okay. Yeah. I think like the last time I played this game I kept missing that one though. And I was always like, where is it? And it, it just it should have been obvious, but Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Again, they're really testing the accuracy of our jumps in this third island. Yeah, there's one. Uh, oh no, that's just a life. Okay. I was like, yeah, there's another one, but no. Okay. Oh no, I don't want this. I don't... <laughs> it's funny, This this becomes like less of a desirable thing as you kind of make your way through the game when like jumping precision and other things seem to matter a bit more it's like uh maybe i don't want this so much Okay. Just checking. Okay. Ah. Jumped a little too late. Good thing I have two of them. I really don't want to go back. 
I'm just gonna hope that I don't have to. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, god damn it. Well, now I do. Fucking Christ. Okay. Oh, god damn it. <laughs> wow. Okay. Okay. Yeah, okay. Oh, right. I need to ride that one and then jump. God damn it. This is not... That's why we have all these lives, because... And again, I want this to be as authentic an experience as I can make it. You came here to be impressed? Well, <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> That's on you? Okay, nice. Not ideal, but okay. It's also just wasted. Like, this takes time jumping across all of these. It is nice to have it when you have this huge wall of boxes in front of you. But, like, imagine trying to make use of this while you're also just trying to jump across all of these. Okay. Timed that correctly. So maybe that bodes well. I do still love the music, though, for this. It's so good. Okay. Oh, okay. That's all I wanted was the checkpoint. This is fun. This is so fun. No! Okay, now I know there is one up there. A Cortex head. I remember this from last the last time I played these games. Um, if you just spin the snake into the TNT like you want to do, because a snake pops up right before you, and your aim is like right there. No, go over there. Okay, yeah. Wait. Yeah, it's right here. Okay. It was, it was just in the question mark box. But like, yeah. You don't just want to have the snake explode that. Because you're going to miss it. And then you're going to be like, Where was it? God, who knows. Again, a nice little secret area. And we get the Cortex stage, where we get the extra key! Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, see, so just want to delay that. Oh, okay. Oh. No! Oh, I just didn't... Oh, I just didn't aim the jump. You fucking... Piece of shit. Talking about myself. 
I love myself. Do I? Probably not. Oh, God. More wine, please. Okay, let's do this. Fucking fuck. Okay, I got this. We can do this. <laughs> this is worth it. This is so worth it. Again, the goal is to not edit this at all, so you'll be able to see the full extent of my dumbassery. So, bully for you. No! God damn it! Ugh! I had it. God, could you imagine just the original when you don't get to repeat this? Right? Like, it's bad enough here. But at least I can repeat it as many times as I want. If I wanted to repeat this, I'd have to exit out of the level and try again and get it perfectly. Okay. Oh, okay. Give me that fucking key, you bitch. There you go. <laughs> oh, great. Man. I guess, right? You're just gonna hear me like complain about that, like ad nauseum and be like, ah, oh, grandpa's on, on, a, on it again. Like, <laughs> just complaining about how much harder they had it back in the day. But it's true, we did. <laughs> like there was no like, oh, just try it again. <laughs> no, that wasn't a thing. Okay, I'm going for it, yep. Okay, there better be, what, 23, yep, okay. So I'll get the gem. Oh, bye. Yeah, the hard part is there's a lot that you can't actually see. Oh, okay. Ooh. So like, I'm just trying to make sure there aren't any boxes up there that like I should be getting. Oh, nope. I don't want to spin that. Okay, well there better be, yep. Great. Did it. And we got the key, so we can go do that other dark level. And what a joy that'll be. Go! Okay. Oh! Yes! <laughs> Jesus Christ, that gave me more trouble than it really should have <laughs> but we did it we're done we're done with that one we can just like put that one behind us and like all the embarrassment nobody will bring it up again because i will cry uh, <laughs> yeah yeah we'll just not bring that one up again okay fumbling in the dark yes this is the one this is the one You'll, you'll see in a second why I say that. Okay, so this this is a tough one. So we actually want to go backward before we go forward, right? Oh, okay. Okay, yep. Now hopefully I can get a checkpoint. Because I don't want to have to do that. Oh, fucking fuck! God damn it. Well, there goes that. There goes that hopefulness. Because the jumping on this can be a little bit hard. Okay, well, I did it again, but still. It's not It's not a fun one. The timing of the jump can be a bit difficult. But, yeah. Again, low box count. Um, whoop. Oh. Yeah, so if you need to, you can jump over to the sides there. Uh, if you don't time it 
quite well enough. I wonder, they might not actually have a checkpoint in this level. Oh, fucking, fuck you. Oh, <laughs> oh this one's gonna be painful. Okay, yep. It'll be very painful. Hope you like watching me suffer. I, I imagine that's why all of you are here. <laughs> and to hear that sound just ad nauseum. Okay, let's do this. Yeah, this one just lines up nicely. The next one won't. So we'll have to do that. And we can do that. Oh god! Really? Fuck you. Okay. What is the hitbox on that fucking scythe? Okay. Now my leg is getting itchy. Everything is just not... Not Gucci, man. Too drunk for this shit. <laughs> At this point. Yeah, this is why I wanted it to just go well and to, like, get a checkpoint, because... After a while, that can get pretty difficult to replicate. There's a lot of factors at play with the with the walls you have to jump jump around, you know, and all this other stuff. It can it can get a little hairy, so I would really, really like a checkpoint, but I don't think that's in the cards for this level, so just have to make do with what we get. Which is not a lot. Not a lot. Oh, okay. I regret this. Ooh! No! No! You fuck. Sorry. Okay. Oh, they give- Oh, thank God. They actually gave me a checkpoint. That is... That is too kind. Too kind. Well, I'm glad they gave me a checkpoint. I feel a little insulted too, but obviously I needed it. Although there's one right here. And I- Okay, yep. There we go. <laughs> that seems right. <laughs> <sighs> I love my life. So good. Oh, okay. Three more boxes. Let's get this fucking over with. Oh, those are scary. Okay. Okay. It's dark again. Okay. Oh! Oh god, oh god! Okay. I can't see. Fucking fuck! I hit the ceiling or whatever. God damn it! Oh, 
Okay, there we go. Okay. Well, that's done. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> yeah, you're the only one who's happy. <laughs> okay. I still can't get that one. So this one, this one, let's talk about. So the green gem grants us a path where it lifts us up and then we can get a whole bunch of lives and basically wind up on the other side of that end level portal without having to go through the actual level, which is nice, but I, well, hey, why not? Let's just do it. I have 87. It's, it's a shit ton of lives, right? Like, more than I needed, but also... <laughs> I need a win. So we'll do it this way, and then we'll do it the regular way to get the gem. Now we're gonna get hit by a shit ton of boxes, because we didn't get any. But... See, it pays to get the special gems. Now let's do it the right way. Or the, you know, whatever. Whatever. Because I want to delay fighting Nitrus Brio. He, it's an annoying battle. I don't like it. Especially this iteration. I feel like it was easier in the originals. <laughs> we can already do the time travel or time trial. I like that they put it down there so you can't just like take the special path. Okay. Yeah, all the music in this game is just so good. We also have to worry about, like, hot pipes and stuff now, and, like, basically running into them. I love how she carries, like, her little computer with her. Nerd. Whew. Those last two are, like, really close. This is nice. Oh, shit. Oh, well, there we go. <laughs> Oh, I love this. Love this so much. All right, at least that isn't too bad. Nope, oh, okay. <laughs> Dangerous. That would have launched us up into the hot pipe, so not a good idea. 
Oh. There we go. Oh no, okay. I hate this. Nope. Okay, that was not the right way to do that. Okay. <laughs> Just that that was an object lesson on what not to do. Yeah, that was that was uh that was just really not what you were supposed to to do. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh Actually, you know what? Yeah. No, what? I I hate 2.5D sometimes. That was that's all that was is Depth perception in 2.5D, right? That's all that could have been. Okay, there we go. Yep. One more box. We can get the fuck out of here. Oh, okay. There it is. Oh, thank Christ. There we go. Oh! <laughs> I love this. This is so much fun. <laughs> Alright, well we basically have to do this now, right? Because we need another gem to get this. We've done everything we can, so yeah, I think I think we're pretty much stuck just Oh great. Okay. Well, here we go. Prepare for a lot of pain. More than we've seen so far in this episode. Yeah, so you want to hop on those things, right? Cool! Okay. Um, and he throws more of the dangerous ones that can just kill you. Cool! Okay. There we go. Okay, now he... He's gonna... I think he might throw some more, right? Yep. Oh, no! Come on! Fuck! Fuck you! And then, that's what I hate about boss fights, is you just, you have to start all the way back at the beginning. No matter how far you get, whether you get to the last hit point, <laughs> or you just hit him once. It's always back to, right back to the start, like, fuck that. Oh, come on! 
Really? Give me a fucking mask then. Like, what am I supposed to fucking do? I guess double back? Yeah, let's try that, actually. We'll try doubling back instead of just running around in a circle around the arena. Let's see if that if that actually makes a difference. Oh, okay. Maybe. The next one is the hardest, right? Okay. Maybe if I start here, right? No, come on! God fucking damn you! This is why I hate this fucking fight. Like, it's not that hard. It's just the stupid... The potion throwing. Like, the blast radius of the... Of the... Or the AoE of the... <laughs> to, to use, you know... MMO terms just seems a little too unforgiving <laughs> for the for the cramped space that that we're in and then like after after the fact it only gets worse uh with it, he'll transform we'll see it in a second but he'll transform and I, I think that only gets fucking worse okay yep Yeah, so he's gonna transform. He also regains health. I mean, not much, but... Right? So then we have to jump on his head. And, like, in the originals, this was also kind of a fun fight for me. But, not anymore. I just, I don't like it. I don't like it at all. I think it's dumb, and... But, we did it. Yay. Good job. Great job, Crash. Yeah, he's gonna try it. Just fuck off. Well, that's done. Okay, we also get... So this is now we can actually teleport to Insanity Beach. We have the lab, which this is this is by far the hardest. Stormy Ascent, or uh, whatever, the, um... I forget what, not Stormy Ascent, but the one where we're actually climbing the castle walls or whatever. That one's also difficult to get the gem in. But honestly, I think this one's harder. Actually, depending on if I do it first time... I might actually go back and get some masks to try to make it easier. Oh, okay. Yeah, I might, because this can get this can get pretty grueling. Not now, but later. Okay. So and then the hard part about this one is you wanna, you know, do that. So you really gotta be, again, just precise with your jumps. Yeah, I do not like to blame controllers, but this one is... It, it's just the Joy-Cons, and it's its doing much better uh, than the third party. I don't know if maybe it just, like, once it gets to a certain battery level, it just doesn't really work that well anymore. Okay. Oh. Oh. Oh.
Oh, nope. <laughs> Forgot about that. Okay. Nope. Okay. Oh, we can just... Yeah! That was always difficult because... Oh, fucking... No, I was there! I was there! Okay, I'm just gonna finish the fucking level. And then we'll come back with, uh, masks. Because... But I was there! <laughs> we all saw it! And now that I know that I can actually just jump around this guy, why would I ever... Why would I ever? <laughs> End of statement. What? What? Are you fucking kidding me? What even was that shit? <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be doing this again, obviously, for the gem. There. Fuck you. <laughs> yeah, this is kind of cheap, but, you know, take what, you know, do what you can. Yeah, we're not going to get the gem. Fuck you. <laughs> I was there. Nearly perfect, but you died. Fuck off. Yeah, don't look at me like that, Crash. You're just as much to blame. We're in this together. Alright, and the Great Hall is interesting. We'll get there in a second, but... We're gonna... <laughs> take advantage of this. This nice little thing. Go back here one more time. And then we're gonna get that fucking gem, and we're gonna backtrack, get the other gems, and go through the Great Hall, which is a really awesome level that they did, and we'll talk about why when we get there, so just hang on to your butts. That was so weird when I had 100 lives. I still, I need to Google that. Like, why was that a thing? Okay, but it doesn't work. Oh, wait, it does work both ways, doesn't it? Watch. Okay, yep. Alright, let's do it. Okay, now, say it with me. No dying.
Okay, and also no fucking up this bonus stage because that's gonna... No! Oh god! Why? Why? Fucking hate my life. Okay. <laughs> oh, there goes the two free hits. No! Maybe I should have saved and then we could just like quit out and just wait for that perfect. No, but that's that's not, you know. We want authentic here. I don't know why. I'm the only one who's asking for it, but <laughs> demanding it even. God. There we go. That one's not too hard. Again, checkpoints are useless to me. heart is racing. You can't tell, but... No! I keep timing it incorrectly. Okay. Okay. I don't, I don't even, I don't, I don't even, nope, nope, I'm not here, don't, don't bother, I don't, 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 oh! <laughs> nope, not even doing that, that's a waste of my fucking time. Well, that, that worked out. Don't know why it did, because nothing is fucking working out right now, but that did. Alright. I'm just gonna get more wine because sanity
All right. Oh my fucking god. Let's try this again. Let's hope we don't fuck up the bonus stage, because, again, that'll just make me feel a little bit more comfortable. Ugh. But of course we probably will. It's not that hard, it just requires a lot of, again, precision. Okay. Well, that... that bodes well. Let's just not fuck it up from here. Oh, I wasn't sure I'd be able to make that jump, but I'm so glad I could. Okay. Now, we can rest slightly easy, but no need to get too comfortable. Come on! Okay. Woo! <laughs> Woo! Okay. Oh my god. Okay. Oh! Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you dance harder for it. <laughs> we worked so much harder. I need more dancing crash. <laughs> Sorry. Ignore me. Uh, yeah, we'll get to the Great Hall in a second, but we need to backtrack and get some of the gems that we haven't been able to get heretofore. Uh, for instance, this one. Actually, we'll get this one first, because then we can do more backtracking. Oh my god. Okay, so again, no dying here. This one's not too bad, though. I'm interested in the, the gem path, though. Hopefully that's not too difficult. I can't remember. Ah! Okay. Yeah, let's time it. And again, if we die, we're just going to have to start the whole level over, so... Oh, 
Okay. Didn't really want that to happen, but whatever. Okay. Here we go. <laughs> Here's for the extra three boxes. I think, though, we won't need to complete... Yes! Okay. So, we won't... <laughs> We we'll need to do the rest of the level. We just get to exit. Yes. I love some of these special paths and their designs. Like they're just so cool, and they they speak to like the uh, the castle that Cortex. All of his stuff is on top of his his dirigible. Okay. Well, we have the purple gem. So now we're just full on backtracking. Let's see where we haven't gotten the gem. Boulder Dash. Yeah, let's let's get that one out of the way. Once we get all the gems, I can't wait to show y'all the uh, the Great Hall. It's it's seriously one of my favorite things in video games ever. Um, so I can't wait to show you all that and and just geek out about it. Cause it's it's fucking cool. It's like one of the best ways to reward game like gamers for like going the extra miles. They really they really do a great job with it, I think. And again, now that we have all the special gems, we don't have to worry about like dying in our quest to get the remaining I think there are only two more gems. I think there are twenty six. Oh shit. Okay. Got it. Also got to pay attention and not, you know, be stupid. That's, that's a thing. Okay, there we go. But yeah, as difficult as some of those were, Crash 2 is a lot harder with some of the uh some of the gems like especially what like it's not that bad until you get to the final warp room and then it's and then it's fucking terrible it's like pulling teeth out so i am not looking forward to that one we will do it uh but i'm not looking forward to it okay so yeah we take the purple gem path And this is actually really fucking cool. Look at this. Hey! Come on! Really? It's depth... Per the only thing about that area is depth perception is really bad there. So, like, trying to figure out where you are in relation to the enemy and, like, their hitbox, that's hard. Uh, so <laughs> we'll have to try that again. Alright, let's do it. We got this. We've done, we've done the hardest things, right? So, all that's left is, like... This nice and easy stuff. We'll get it. We'll get it. Yeah, it looks cool, but kind of hard to kind of hard to gauge. Oh, okay. Oh, there we go. At least we won't be wanting for lives, right? Look at that. <laughs> nice. Okay, so there should be one more gem. And then... And I think it's the Great Gate? Or, um... Yeah, the Great Gate. All the way back. 
Right? Yeah. Okay. And then we'll go to the Great Hall, and then we'll face off with Cortex. Which, again, is another one that just... it's not... I don't know, it's... Maybe I'm just, like... Getting at the fact that I really... I don't like boss battles. Like, the platforming aspect is great, but I just... I, I do not like the boss battles. <laughs> Some of them used to be fun. But, I don't know. I just, I can't do it. There's, they're asking too much of me. Run! Okay. <laughs> nice. Woo! Nope. Get the fuck out of here. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's fine. Yeah, and I can never remember which gem is required for this level. Like, that's the one that, like, there are some where I'm like, oh, it's definitely this gem. This one, I never remember. But we finally got it. This one's actually super hard. Because again, it relies on kind of precision jumping ability. Shit. Uh do I? I'm gonna chance it. There's a hidden box back there. I don't know if there was one in the first one. I hope not, because I'd miss it. Oh, shit. I guess if I die, it's not the end of the world, since I'm not sure if I missed a box, but... Uh, okay, there it goes. Okay, well, there's one. Okay, there's the other. Thank God. Okay! 
Well, that's all 26 gems. So now we're going to go through the Great Hall. And we're going to see something pretty fucking cool. I, I think it's... I, again, I think it's one of the coolest things in gaming. It's one of the... Uh, one of the greatest ways to reward players for, like... Wanting to... Do excellent... Uh, why am I going this way? Wanting to do excellently. Um... Let's go ahead. So this is the Great Hall. Now normally... Normally... We'll see. We'll see what happens. Normally, you just hop across and... You exit. Because you don't have all the gems. Right? So like... If you just... Do the bare minimum and beat every level... That's fine. But if you have all the gems... You can come this way. And you can keep going. You see Tana. Hey, cutie. Yeah, yeah, we like you. Yeah, uh, th those green eyes especially. Oh, I didn't even notice that. She has green eyes. That is... That is a big turn on. Uh, yeah. Uh, I'll just be over here for a sec. You, you, you guys, uh... Occupy yourselves. Um, yeah. So, and then... We come to this curtain, and... And this music is the best, by the way. But... Yeah, we get here. The curtain opens. Here we are, strutting, and... Oh! There she is. I gotta say, massive improvement from the polygon version that we got in the original. Yeah, and then we get this little interesting stuff. Papu sold the ruins of the Castle Cortex to a res resort developer, then used the proceeds to open a big and tall shop on the island. <laughs> After intense therapy and eight years of higher education, Dr. Ru went on to write the well-received book, Through the Eye of the Vortex, a study of rapid evolution and its consequences. While Kong moved to Hollywood and landed a motion picture deal of universal proportions, Currently, he's working with a speech therapist to improve his diction. <laughs> Pinstripe moved to Chicago, where he now owns and operates a citywide sanitation company. He's saving money for his upcoming gubernatorial campaign. <laughs> Get into politics. After the disappearance of his mentor, uh, Dr. Nitris Brio rediscovered his first love, tending bar. <laughs> I don't know if I would take a cocktail from him. The world has heard nothing more of Cortex since Crash foiled its plans, but evil geniuses are harder to squash than cockroaches. I wouldn't know. But isn't that cute? So, in the original, we can actually end the game that way. And, and actually get like the credit the credits will roll and 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 that's like the game obviously they will then say hey do you want to fight neo cortex which you can and we're gonna do now but again just that's a way you can actually end the game especially in the original Whoa! oh god okay well <laughs> Darn you, Crash Bandicoot. Oh, yeah, that's the one we actually want to... There we go. I love this music, too. Ooh, okay. Oh, God. Oh. Well, we have 99 lives, so... I, I hate, again, I hate the boss battles. Ah. Ah. Damn it. Ah. 
Okay, now we have to get three. Ooh! And, the, the, and these, like, oscillate now. Oh! No! Fuck you! Can I get a mask, please? Should I just kill myself? And no, I'll just... I'll try. I'll try, but, like... <laughs> can I just die enough to get a mask? Like a freebie? Look, his castle is on fire, too. Look at that. Like, we have wreaked havoc... On his... Fucking... Oh, come on! I spun that, you fucking bitch! Okay. Yeah. Okay, we'll just, we'll wait, we'll wait. Oh! Oh my fucking god! Can we, can we please get a mask or something? Oh, okay. Okay. There we go. That's what I wanted. <laughs> I hate the boss battles. Like, those make this... Like, especially... I don't know why, but in the remakes especially, they make it so much less enjoyable. I don't know if, the, if, if like, that's on purpose, like, they were trying to make the boss battles more challenging, but, like... The enjoyable part about the challenge is, like, the platforming stuff, not this shit. Or at least for me. Like, I, I don't care about challenging boss battles if, if the platforming stuff is actually challenging. Maybe that's just me, but... I just, like, I don't give a shit. Like... Come on. Oh god, okay. Okay. Huh. Okay. Okay, he's got two hit points left. Oh god. No! Fuck you! I hate this. I hate this so much. Can we just end this, please? <laughs> Why didn't I just end this with the Great Hall? Ugh. Okay, yeah, yeah, I'm just gonna... Can we... Yeah, there we go. Because I'm not wasting it on that part. Like, you're a nerd on a hoverboard. Can I just, like... <laughs> jump at you and... I don't know, or... I don't know, call you lame and you just, like, your self-esteem just blows up. I don't know. There we go. Damn. 
Can we have two, please? How about I just... Yeah, let's just do this until we get two. There we go. Okay. <laughs> I'm not proud. Pride? Doesn't even fact... Okay, well... Let's not... There we go. Yeah, yeah. Honestly, the Cortex battle in the third one is so much worse than this, though. So, I don't... Oh, come on! I'm not, I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. Not doing it. No, nope, not, not for that. Okay, so I'll just... I won't try to get both of them. I won't be greedy. <laughs> but honestly, yeah, the Cortex battle in the, in the third one is so much worse than this. There we go. Okay. We can get it. Oh. There. Okay, you got two hit points left. Oh. Oh god, okay. Collect yourself. Oh god, okay. Okay, one more, one more. God. Oh, thank god. I did not have any faith in me. But there we go. That's it. That's that's Crash Bandicoot 1. Oh. Look at that hair. God damn. Yep, so we'll let the credits roll because, you know, I feel strongly about, you know, giving credit where credit's due, so. This, this is the, uh, obviously the, uh, Warthog Riding Levels theme song, but yeah, th this was great. I'm, I'm glad I did this. There were obviously some moments of sheer frustration, but other than that, just such a fun thing to do. I can't wait to do the second and third. I, I'm not sure if I'll take a break between them. We'll have to see, but like, super fun. Um... Again, this is totally, like, nostalgia-fueled, so... Yeah, I don't know. I, I, I hope you all enjoyed kind of going through this with me. I, I really like uh, kind of especially talking about, like, the differences between the originals and the Insane Trilogy, especially having grown up with the original trilogy um, and, like, played them to death. That's the thing like an embarrassing amount even like this is just kind of going into the backstory of me or like the lore of Ravenrook but like my sister got the PlayStation 1 for Christmas I was like I forget how old I was but I was young maybe 5 or 6 when she got it for Christmas and like she would only let me play it sometimes, me and my brother. And so we fell in love with Crash Bandicoot. But what we would do is when she wouldn't let us play it, we would like tape like our own drawings of like PlayStation controllers and Crash Bandicoot scenes to like different like li like basically like the uh what is it? Uh 
like the record player case, we would tape like a scene from Crash Bandicoot and like make cut out controllers and pretend we were playing until she'd let us play it again. So like, that's where I'm coming from with this. That that amount of nostalgia and like childhood memories is having that kind of obstacle and then also just kind of even even though I couldn't actually play the game I I loved it so much that I was like let me at least like pretend that I'm playing it which is embarrassing to admit but also like I don't care like that's how much I love it that's how much I love Crash Bandicoot we had like uh some of the uh like they made like a Crash Team Racing like RC it wasn't really an RC because it had a cable that like you had the the controller for the for the car and then like there was a cable so so like it couldn't actually like you couldn't be distances away from it like it it it, it, it was restricted by how long the cable was you know um, we also had some Crash Bandicoot like action figures but yeah it was it, Crash Bandicoot like was a huge part of my life. Still is. Like, when I'm sick, I'll come back and play these games because it's just, it's so comforting. When I'm bored, whatever. Seriously, just so much love for this series. Honestly, as a gamer, there are some games where I'm like, I could. I could probably imagine my life without it, but Crash Bandicoot is one where I just, I couldn't imagine what my life would be without it. Oh no. I love that they're kind of throwing in some of the soundtracks from the second and the third game, by the way. Nice little... Nice little foreshadowing to what, what we have to look forward to next. My controller just went to sleep. Uh, but again, I want to make sure we get through all the credits. Because I think it's... I, I do think it's important to kind of let... You know, give credit to the amazing people who who all had a hand in this project. And and all the projects, you know, that I, that I play on my channel, that I review on my channel... But I do extra content for on my channel. It's, it's important to kind of throw it back to the amazing people who made this all possible. people though <coughs> Wow, even the legal department makes it it makes the cut. Good for you guys. Hey, I'm sure you had a purpose. Oh, this is the jetpack uh, song for the jetpack levels. <laughs> Honestly, like, as I kept doing parts of this, I was like, this seems so daunting, like, I don't know if I'll be able to, to do it. Um, 
Honestly, I'm mostly daunted for the final warp room in Crash 2. That's like, that's gonna be like... That, I think, is more difficult than... Especially like if you're going for the gems. That is more difficult than anything else in, in the entire Crash trilogy. That's gonna pose the greatest kind of obstacle so we'll see, we'll see how I do with that. I I died a lot uh, on the third island, and I and I anticipated that, but you know, I was still a little bit like deflated by how much I actually died on this final part of the playthrough. It, it was it was kind of embarrassing, but you know, it is what it is. Okay, so I've played enough games and beaten enough games to know that if we get to the special thanks, we're about done with the credits, so hopefully that is also true here. I don't know if I've ever watched these credits because I've never had a reason to. Whoa! The time trial developer is their best times. That's kind of interesting. I like that. Whoa! That is really interesting, actually. I, I kind of want to see if I can beat those times, but I'm, I'm glad they listed those there. I probably couldn't. I'm, I'm not really great with doing things quickly, thinking, thinking quickly. No bandicoots were harmed in the creation of this game. I love it. I love it. Oh, look at that. Look at that. So cute. Alright, let's do one final save to uh, make sure it has our 100% save. Look at that. Okay. Well, this is the end of the episode. We've gotten 100% on Crash 1 at some point. Who knows when? We'll pick up on Crash 2 and then eventually Crash 3. Uh, you know, but... Uh, as always, for this video, leave a like if you like, a dislike if you don't, comment, subscribe, do what you gotta do. And I'm hopping off, and uh, we will, we will, whatever. See y'all next time. Peace!